Hello and welcome to King of Titan Racing. I'm in Dubai, which is wonderful, but I have lunch plans in Abu Dhabi. How to get there? That's my challenge. Now I have a few options available to me, but it needs to be quick. It needs to be convertible so I can enjoy the sun. And it needs to have a bit of practical storage because we need a few outfit changes. So I could pull out a Mercedes convertible, but I'm not going to. For me, there is one choice. The Porsche Boxster GTS 4 Lisa. For me, this is a bittersweet drive. It's a journey of a car that never existed. I spent quite a bit of time with Porsche, deciding if I should get my very own set of these. By the time I come up with my own spec, my very own halo spec, they close the allocations. So, before I show you how I would have built this thing, let me show you why I wanted one in the first place. Let's turn our attention to the interior and Porsche has one of the best in the market right now personal opinion and I especially like them when they're split like this with the two colours it really accentuates the way this central column is attached to the dash but on this particular one I can't really do it justice because a GTS to me should be covered in Alcantara which is how it comes as standard you have to optionally delete the Alcantara to go back to levers which is what this owner's done but even though it's Alcantara everywhere normally, it doesn't have to be a boring place to be. There's options to get colour all over this, and let me show you where. This chrome strip and this central piece, they can be done to body match the car. So if you've gone for something a bit rogue, like an orange or a yellow, that's quite loud. The stitching. we have got the red stitching, you can still have that. You can also have a crayon colour, which again goes back to no colour, but you can do that as an option. On top of that, you've got the dials. It's a GTS, you've got a chrono. Yellow, red, or white, or black as you can see. And finally, you've got the seat belts. So if you really wanted to, you could cover this in color, but I really can't stress enough just how nice the base GTS interior actually is. The Alcantara race tech mix. Looking at the exterior features, it is of course a Porsche, which means all the usual rules apply for calipers. Yellow will only be found on the carbon ceramics, and these red ones come standard on a GTS. On a normal boxer, I believe they come in black. These beautiful wheels, however, are also standard on the GTS, and I think the best design they do for the boxer. At the back of the door, we find these huge air intakes, which can be done in black, as they are here, but also satin orium or body color. The boring practical stuff, but actually quite impressive, is the amount of space you get at the front here. In the rear, they've not lost any space by moving to the six cylinder over the four. You can still see how far that gimbal goes up so you can get a full length set of golf clubs in there and I can very easily fit my bag full of camera equipment. The rear of the car is one of the better designs on the Boxster with the standardized smoked tail lights, sports pack design, and of course the sports exhaust system. So what do you get for your 75,000 pounds or in its 90s as I expect mine? you get a straight six four liter engine doing 0 to 60 in four seconds in the automatic like this four and a half in the manual and it goes on to 179 miles an hour with the engine in the center so it's a pretty good all-round driver's car so let's show you how mine would have looked so let's start with the exterior color i was going for miami blue which as you can see is a little bit louder than the silver we have here I was absolutely going to go for these wheels and the GTS writing on the side, of course, but I was not going to go for red calipers. No, no, I was going to choose the carbon ceramic bright yellows. Now all that color would have been nicely balanced out by the dark roof, the smoked rear taillights and the dark side plates. I hope you can see why I wanted one of these in my collection. 
fact is it's such a great all-rounder car and it's so much fun to drive sadly though just the sun has just set on this beautiful arabian day it is set on my chance to get one of these and spec it the way i wanted my search will continue in the second hand market but i may be waiting a while thanks for watching and we'll see you soon Oh, my God.